What's good, y'all? It's Juno here, man, and welcome back for another Mail Time Monday, man. If you haven't read the title yet, we got ourselves another one, another Personal Fears haul video. Personal Fears is an Instagram jewelry brand. They make some dope, dope, dope ass stuff. I fuck with PF real heavy. Shout out to homie Tosh. Was good, Tosh. I hope you see this, bro. Was good, Brody. We got a second haul video. We got some items that I didn't get from the last haul video. If you haven't seen the first one, I suggest you go watch that. There's like over 600 views on there or some. So you should definitely go watch that. And you feel me? Go like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. But here goes my second PF haul video. I got all kinds of stuff. I'm very excited to finally put all of the drip on myself. But before we get into the video, your boy got his own discount code. I got an affiliate code. So if you see anything you like in this video or you just go check out the website, don't forget to use code Juno Fears. That's J U N O. Fears all together, lowercase, no space, just Juno Fears. If you use that code, you get 10% off of any order off of your whole order. So you could use Juno Fears as many times as you want, 10% off. Um, who doesn't want to do that? Who wouldn't want some discounted drip? You feel me? So make sure to use code Juno Fears if you decide to shop PF yourself. I'm going to be leaving personal fears information down in a bar below. That's the website, the Instagram, the Snapchat, the Twitter, all that good stuff. I'm going to leave all that down in the bar below. But besides that, that's going to be it, man. Make sure to leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And at the end of the video, comment your favorite piece that I got in today's PF haul video. We finally going to see everything that's in this box. All the drip, man. Let's get it. So, real quick, before we actually get into the jewelry, man, I got myself three beanies, bro. I'm going to show each beanie real quick, but... Here goes the packaging right there. It says personal fears right there in a little bag, a little kind of clear-ish bag. Um, and every single beanie came in a bag like that. It says personal fears. Um, I'm just going to show every single beanie real, real quick. And then we're going to get into the jewelry. Here goes the first beanie right there. It is the PF logo. That is PF right there. It's like backwards or inverted or some crap. I don't know how to explain. But there goes PF logo. It's a black beanie. The blue and white logo right there and a the black beanie. Pretty simple beanie. There's nothing else all around it. But here goes the first one. Here goes the second beanie. It has white stars and it says Fears in all red right there inside of the stars. Similar beanie, just all black with the front design right there. But here goes the second personal fears beanie. And then third and last beanie we got says fears right there. And it's got an explosion on top of the world. What? That's a pretty dope design right there, man. It says, it say fear or fears? Oh, yeah. It says fears, but... The A or whatever is that world exploding, whatever the case be. But besides that, there goes the three beanies. They're all black and they just say fears like these two. Or it's got the PF logo like this one. Um, honestly, this is probably my favorite beanie. The one with the world exploding. Only because it has the most detail. It has the dopest design in my opinion. But every single design on the beanie is embroidered on there. So it's that good quality. You feel me? It's not super hard embroidery. The designs themselves are kind of simple. So this one is probably the hardest because it's one design. But these are more bendy because there's like space in between. But like I said, this is my favorite one right here. Let me know in the comments what is your favorite beanie from personal fears that I got in this video and with every single beanie came a little set of pins I'm not going to show the pins they just they're a bunch of random designs one of them says fuck off respectively another one says personal fears one of them them says messed up another one says depressed there's just all kinds of pins and stuff like that but Pretty dope. He gives us for free. Every single time you buy a beanie, you get a little package with three pins. So, I got nine pins now. I don't even be wearing pins. Enough of me showing the little accessory knickknack petty wax. Now we're finally going to get into the actual jewelry, bruh. 
Let's see what's inside of the box. Let's get to the drip. And almost every single order that PF sends out, they give the homie a high chew, bruh. You might get a high chew. He tries to give it out in every single order. It, he gets it out in probably like 95% of the orders. It has a little high chew. Um, I already ate mine, bruh. As soon as I saw it, I, I grabbed that shit and I ate it. But here goes my little high chew, man. And then there's two stickers that I got in this order. One of them is like a liquefied PF logo right there. And this one is like this devil girl with some big O. You feel me? And it says fears along the side right there. And the bottom it says 2021 personal fears jewelry. And her herself, she's actually wearing a PF logo chain right there. That's pretty cool. I didn't see that earlier. That's a pretty cool design right there. But here goes the two stickers I got. Now, all the jewelry I got is inside this orange wrapping paper. The two colors that PF really, really fucks with is green and orange. And my last video, I also got my drip in the orange wrapping paper. There goes some green baggies you about to see in a second. But here goes all the drip. So we got ourselves a bunch of baggies, bro. We got one bag, two bag, three bag, four bag, five bag, six bag, and a case right here. So we got six little baggies. I'm going to try to go through all of them real quick. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of pieces in this video. You're gonna want to watch the whole thing, bruh But here goes all the little baggies. They all are in green and it says right there Personal fears in that font right there and it's like on fire It says PF right there the letters and there goes that personal fears I don't know what that says that might be personal fears in Japanese, but honestly, I'm not hundred percent sure But here goes the baggies the green baggies. They also got some little orange wrapping paper But first we're gonna get into whatever's in this case. It's just an orange case and right there is a PF logo on top of it so we're gonna see what's in this case and then we're gonna see everything that's in these baggies let me take off the jewelry I already got on and let's see what I got in this PF haul video so here goes the case right there and inside we have a chain and a pendant man this is called the biohazard pendant right there biohazard the biohazard logo like you know, whenever you see something that's biohazardous, it looks like that. That's what's on there. I think it's exactly the same or it's similar. I don't 100% remember. But here goes the pendant. On the back of it, it just says PF right there in the middle. It's a little hard to see because of the lighting. And then here goes the biohazard pendant. It's got a curb chain, I believe. Um, I know this isn't a Cuban. I don't remember what kind of chain it is, though. I think it's a curb chain. But nonetheless... Here goes that first chain and pendant. It's that biohazard pendant, man. Um, I got a few chains and a few rings in this video. No bracelets, unfortunately. Here goes that biohazard pendant and chain on me. I'm not 100% sure how many inches this chain is. I think it's 20 or 22 inches. I don't really remember. But here goes the biohazard pendant. It is a little smaller than I thought it'd be, honestly. But there goes the chain and pendant, man. Actually, I just checked, and this is 22 inches. So, the Cuban chain that I usually wear from Hard Jewelry is 24 inches. So, if you saw this one earlier, right, it is a little longer than this chain. Just a tad bit longer. Here goes 22-inch chain with the pendant. Now, we're finally going to see what's inside the six baggies right here. Let's get through all of them. Here goes the second piece, the second chain and pendant. It is a hockey mask pendant, you feel me? Shout out Jason from Friday the 13th, man. Here goes that hockey mask pendant and the chain. I'm actually not sure what kind of chain this is, honestly, like what link chain this is. On the back of it, it says PF on the bell part right there, but not on the actual piece. It actually says 13, has the number 13, like Friday the 13th from Jason, man. So there goes the hockey mask pendant now let me put this bad boy on so here goes the hockey mask pendant the chain is exactly the same as this one lengthwise it is 22 inches different type of chain but there goes the biohazard with the hockey mask jason pendant right there so here goes the first two pieces of jewelry 
before we get into the next piece, I actually forgot to show this. It says, personal fears, real jewelry for real people, man. There goes that it's highlighted right there, 22 inches. I usually barely, barely ever get anything 18 inches. I definitely don't get anything 16. My neck is too fat for that. Usually, it's between 20 to 24 inches. I like my chains a little longer, so I got to 22 inches, but you know, for you... It's personal preference, depends how long you like your chains. I just like mine a little longer. We're finally getting to the first ring here. This is a Cuban link ring. Cuban links are my absolute favorite, favorite chains, but I decided to get the Cuban link ring. I have a couple different link rings, like uh, Cuban link and curb link uh, rings though, you know, not the chains. I got a bunch of chains, bro. But this is like my third or fourth like link ring right there. It's just all around the same pattern. Um, so here goes the first personal fears ring. It fits real nice. This is a size nine for this ring. I am different sizes and different different fingers and stuff but this is a size nine if it's real nice it's nice and thick but not super heavy like it's like like it's a thin ring but it's also thick at the same time i don't know it's just you just gotta wear it and feel it to know what i mean but it fits real nice and inside right there you can't see it but it does say pf it says personal fears inside of there but here goes the first pf ring here goes the second ring bro but this ring goes so hard this is the pf logo ring and on the sides of it it's got like flames right there right there on the sides it doesn't go all the way around it stops in the back just a little gap right there but it's got flames on both sides right there of the ring and it's just a fat blackened background with a fat old pf right there the ring is very thick it's heavier than i thought it was like look at that shit that shit is so thick bruh but this ring goes so hard pf ring with the blackened background i really fuck with that like i really like this ring um, I like it more than this one. Unfortunately, Cuban ring, I'm sorry, bro. But this ring is just, look at that shit. This is, this is insane, bro. Here goes the second ring. It is the third green baggie. So we are halfway through all of the drip. We got three more baggies to show. Then we're going to wrap it up. But let me know in the comments down below. So far, what is your favorite piece that I got? Is it the PF ring? Is it the Cuban link ring? Is it the hockey mask pendant and chain? Or is it the biohazard pendant and chain? Let me know in the comments down below. What is your favorite piece that I got so far halfway through the drip? Honestly, for me, it's got to be the PF ring. This goes so fucking hard. I love it. This goes insane, bro. But everything I've gotten so far is all super nice, super fucking lit. But now we got... Three more baggies. Let's see what else we got in this video, man. And here goes the third and very last ring I'll be showing in this video. It is an eight ball ring. This is the second eight ball ring that I own. I own another eight ball ring from Thrifty Jewelry. If you haven't watched my Thrifty haul video, a little plug, you feel me? I'm gonna leave a little link right here. Go watch my Thrifty video. But here goes my second eight ball ring. This one is a little thinner, a little lighter than the other one I have from Thrifty Jewelry. Nonetheless, this goes super fun fucking hard i love it it's simple nothing on the bands or nothing like that just silver band with the black and silver right there and this is really light it is pretty light but it is kind of thick right there where the bald part is and i like the way that it like skinnies out around the back i really like that right there but here goes the eight ball ring it is a very very last ring i'll be showing in this video so what's left is two more baggies we got two more chains slash pendants that you'll see in a second but here goes the two bags right there but that's it for the rings we got the PF ring, the eight ball ring, and the Cuban link ring, man. Here goes the second to last piece, bruh. And oh my gosh. Honestly, I kind of bought this as a joke. I don't know when I'm going to ever actually wear this. But if you can read it, it says horny. This says horny right there. Like, it, this is actually pretty sharp. Like, I'm touching it. And, like, the little ends or whatever right there are actually pretty sharp. But that... 
in that font it says horny right there it's a little hard for the camera to focus because of the lighting and because like it's not like a full pendant you know there's like spaces in between so it's a little hard for the camera to pick it up but here goes that horny chain man i don't know what kind of chain this is i've had a couple things with a chain similar to this one i just don't know what kind of link it's called but there goes that horny pendant is automatically connected to the chain so unlike these right here you can mix and match the different chains and pendants and stuff like that. But this one is stuck with this one for life. There's nothing wrong with that. I fuck with chains like this. Honestly, I don't have very many. I only have a few where it's like stuck with the chain, if you know what I mean. So here goes the chain and pendant. And here goes that horny chain. It is adjustable. So you couldn't see, but on the back of it, there's like a few different links you could put it on. But there goes the horny chain, bruh. I did not think I was going to get this chain. When I first saw it, I was like, bruh. That's hilarious. Like, I don't think I'm actually ever wear this out, bro. Like, I, I don't know. Maybe. Sometimes you never wear something, but then there's that right situation where you have to wear it or you should wear it because of whatever. I don't know. Maybe in the future, I'll be rocking this in public. There goes the horny chain. Now, we got one more piece, but this is the last piece we got in today's video, bruh. Let's see what's inside of the baggie. And here goes the very last item slash chain. It is a 9 millimeter thick, 20 inch long Cuban chain, bruh. Like you saw earlier, I was wearing this Cuban chain. This is from Hard Jewelry. It is 10 millimeters, and it is 24 inches. So, the one I usually wear is a little thicker, just a little teeny winny incy wincy bit thicker and a little bit longer as well. But we got this chain right here. I was so excited for this one. It is 20 inches, so it's the same length as everything else I got today, and it is 9 millimeters. It's a pretty thick one. It's not as thick as the one I wear on a daily basis, but nonetheless, it's a pretty thick boyo, you feel me? But here goes the last piece. Let me put this bad boy on. We're going to complete the whole fit right now. So here goes every single thing that I got in today's video, man. We got ourselves the Cuban chain right here. 20 inches, 9 millimeters. It's a big, fat, thick chain. The horny chain right there. I still can't believe I got this, but there goes the horny chain, man. And then we got the biohazard pendant with chain right there. And then the Jason hockey mask pendant. There goes all the chains and pendants that I got today. Make sure to leave a comment. What is your favorite chain slash pendant that I got in this video? Now here goes the three rings I got. I got the Cuban link ring right there. I got the eight ball ring and I got the PF ring. So make sure to comment which one of these rings are your favorite as well. And then we also got the three beanies. Like I said, these right here and the one I'm wearing. These are the three beanies that I got. Let me know in the comments down below your favorite beanie as well. But there goes absolutely every single thing that I got in this video, man. I had a lot of stuff. Um, but it's all bangers, they're all slappers, they're all blappers, you feel me? So make sure to, like I said earlier, leave a comment, what is your favorite item that I got in the video? Or, what is your favorite ring, favorite chain slash pendant, and favorite beanie that I got in the video? I got a good variety of different things. The only thing I didn't get in this video was a bracelet, because unfortunately, PF does not have many, many different bracelets on the website. They only have like two or three, I believe. And and only like one of them, but I already know they're gonna come out with some more heat in the future. But besides that, leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and don't forget to use code Juno Fears. Use code Juno Fears at checkout for 10% off of your whole order. So the more you spend, the more savings you get. Because if you spend 50 bucks, that's five dollars off. You spend 500 bucks, that's $50 off so you know just do your math you feel me but make sure to always always use code Juno fears J-U-N-O F-E-A-R-S lowercase all together Juno fears man but that's gonna be it I'm out of here like a belly button we go wrap this thing up 
like a burrito. Go check out my other Mail Time Mondays. I'm trying to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of 2021. So make sure to go watch my hard jewelry, my thrifty haul video, my other PF video, all my haul videos on my Mail Time Mondays, even some of my past reactions, all that. Make sure to go, you feel me? Go fuck with the boy. But I'm out of here, man. Yark!